सो हेलो फ्रेंड्स टूडेज टॉपिक वॉज अबाउट बेसिक्स ऑफ वॉट इज अनइवेननेस वॉट इज क्रॉस लेवल वॉट इज अलाइनमेंट वॉट इज ट्विस्ट ओके इन रेलवे ट्रैक सो फर्स्ट लेटेस्ट लुक आफ्टर द डेफिनेशन ऑफ वॉट इज अनइवेननेस राइट सो अनइवेननेस मीन्स इट इज द अंडुलेशंस अंडुलेशंस आर डिप्स इन वन लाइन ऑफ ट्रैक आल्सो कॉल्ड एज लॉन्गिट्यूडनल लेवल इट इज सपरेट मेजर्ड सपरेटली फॉर लेफ्ट रेल एंड राइट रेल मीन्स वॉट सपोज यू हैव ए जनरली यू विल हैव टू रेल्स सो यू विल टेक वन रेल जस्ट यू विल टेक वन रेल सो दिस इज एल एच रेल दिस इज आर एच रेल ओके यू हैव टू टेक वन रेल एंड वॉट एवर अंडुलेशंस आर देर right means whatever ups and downs are there in this single rail okay that is called unevenness so you will measure this undulations are unevenness separately for left rail separately for right rail okay so this is called unevenness now next concept is cross level cross means what see if you have a track this is called a cross or cross level and this is longitudinal level this is cross level and this is longitudinal level this is longitudinal level this is cross level right so see let us say this is lh rail and this is rh rail okay now in previous unevenness i said that you will measure undulations separately for lh rail separately for rh rail but in cross level okay you have to measure relatively with respect to this rail what is this rail what is the level of this rail okay so so that is called cross level suppose see now if you see the definition if both rails are at same level then the cross level is said to be zero see now these two rails are at same level then cross level is said to be zero suppose left rail was lower than right rail by 5 mm 5 mm then cross level is said to be 5 l means what 5 mm left left rail low right suppose right rail was lower than left rail by 10 mm then cross level is said to be 10 r okay so the this is how cross level was indicated right if both rails are at same level cross level equal to 0 if left rail was lower by 5 mm then cross level is said to be 5l if right rail is lower by 10 mm cross level is said to be 10r right so relatively it is not separately it is relatively measured right so this is cross level next alignment it is the misalignment of rail it is the misalignment of rail with respect to center of track with respect to center of track both rails are to be straight suppose see you have a track like this and this is the center of the track and you have one more picture like this not to and you have like this and this is the center of the track see assume that this is straight see with respect to center this rail and this rail are straight are straight okay and with respect to center this rail is misaligned it is not straight okay this is misaligned okay in this direct it at this location it has came inside at this location it has gone outside right it at this location it came inside so this is called alignment so if they are straight with respect to center then the rail is said to be straight if they are misaligned with respect to center then they have alignment right okay so this is called alignment now let us go through next concept called twist twist means what algebraic difference of cross level divided by chord length so cross level i already told you what is the suppose at this location this is left rail and this is right rail at this location left rail was lower by 3 mm okay at this location right rail was lower by 5 mm at this location left rail was lower by 10 mm so 
three mm. This was indicated as what? Three L. This was indicated as what? Ten L. This was indicated as five R. Now, how to calculate twist? So twist is algebraic difference. Algebraic means what? Sine with the sine. So let us say our left side was taken as negative. So this is also taken as negative. Our right side was taken as positive. So let us take this as positive. Now twist. is algebraic difference between so let us say this is station 1 station 2 station 3 okay so station and cross level if you take okay station 1 2 3 at station 1 you have 3l minus station 2 you have plus 5r and station 3 you have okay minus 10r right now twist is equal to twist is equal to What algebraic difference? So I am taking sine also minus three. So I want to calculate twist between one and two. So minus three plus uh, minus three difference rate right? minus three minus plus five whole divided by cord length. Cord length means distance between stations at which you measure. Assume that it is a short cord and you are taking three meters. So in this case, twist is equal to minus three minus five by three, which is equal to eight by three. Mm per meter. So this is how we will calculate the twist, right? So similar way you can calculate for different stations also. So I hope this clear to you. Now overall, if you see, see first, I we have discussed about the concept called unevenness, unevenness. So just to take the single track and look after the surface, undulations in the surface, right? is there any ups and downs okay you have to take one cord or wire you can take thread you can take and hold it and see is there any ups and downs with respect only single track that is called unevenness and next we have seen cross level cross level means level difference between this track and this track level difference between this rail and this rail level difference between this rail and this rail so that is called as cross level then you also seen alignment so with respect to center of this track okay is there any alignment right so that is called alignment and twist based on cross level you will calculate twist so i hope this all these concepts were clear to you okay thank you for watching